Hello, welcome to Dwayne's World. It's me, Dwayne the Booze and Blogger, coming at you for Tuesday, April 28th during this COVID fucking mess. I think it's day 522, maybe. Uh, I'm not sure. Going to skip the stats today and just get on to some stories. I hope that's okay with everybody else. So here we go. Ah, finally some good news for the change. For a change here, the elementary school teachers ratified a uh, contract for three years, so at least there'll be no strikes in the public schools if they ever get back from COVID. Seriously, after this COVID crap, these students shouldn't get an extra day off, like, forever. This has been the longest fucking snow day in the history of fucking snow days. And it just keeps adding up. So we have fucking idiots in Canada uh, protesting the stay-at-home orders. That's right, they're all in front of the uh, the Parliament in Toronto protesting. I say we get water cannons and we fill them with indelible ink, maybe orange or blue, and fire it at them. So it gets all over them. And it takes like 14, 15 days for the ink to wash off. That way, if we see them walking down the street, we can avoid them so we're not getting the fucking coronavirus. And not to mention, then if they go to the hospital for COVID, the hospital staff can tell them to go fuck themselves since they were trying to kill everybody else. I think that's a great fucking idea. On to world news. So we keep getting news that Kim Jong-un, uh, North Korea's supreme being, is dead. Then we get the fucking more reports that he's still alive. Nobody can fucking figure it out. I think I figured it out, folks. What if he's hiding just because he went to fat camp or had a facelift or stomach stapled? You know, many wi women do this a lot after their cosmetic surgeries. Won't we all look like a, dumb, a bunch of dumb idiots when he comes out of hiding, 150 pounds lighter and looking like a Korean Joe Exotic? So now scientists are saying that maybe there's something in uh, Pets at AC that can help track the uh, coronavirus, help cure the coronavirus. Of course they shouldn't have fucking said anything because now the media puts it all out. And guess what people are hoarding now? Yeah, that's right. The fuckers are hoarding Pepsi AC. When they can't find Pepsi AC, they'll start hoarding fucking Tums probably and then they'll be breaking into the school stealing all the chalk. Dumb fucking people. I think the next thing the uh, government should say is going to help uh, coronavirus is fucking Axlax. Yeah, it's real shitty. And uh, at least with all the hoarded toilet paper everybody has, they'll be ready for the onslaught of diarrhea. I was watching TV the other day, and uh, I saw the news that dogs could be trained to sniff out the COVID-19 in humans. Yep. Wouldn't it be cool if sharks could do the same thing? Sharks, yeah. So then they can eat the fucking idiots heading to the beaches in Florida? Only makes sense to me. Well, now you're caught up in all the news that needs to be read for today from me, uh, April 28th. I'll be back tomorrow with some more news. Uh, please subscribe to my channel. Remember, don't be fucking hoarding shit and don't be one of these peps a day CD fucking eating motherfuckers either. Uh, be nice to everybody. Take care of yourselves. And always, always remember, don't be a fucking asshole!